Now the question is, what pre-workout should I use today? I'm thinking I might try these out. So hitting up one of these, just one sachet, try it out. So what I'm doing is, doing a bit of a fasted session this morning. Uh, went to my sister's last night with Aish, and we had a shitload of heaters. So um, feeling kind of on the bodgy side. Give it a shake up. Let's try it. The general taste, pretty darn good. Let's go. going on guys a uh, quick chat about the weekend and about how I'm feeling um, it's Monday I've just finished my workout and it was a brilliant workout um, not that high intensity but you know enough to feel the pump what an amazing weekend I had literally one of the best weekends I've had in such a long time um, Saturday was one of the best days of my life I met my kind of my not inspira yeah my inspiration probably my inspiration well i think the people i met at body power just summed up my last year of my life the kind of well the last half year of my life really um the whole motivation to start vlogging the whole oh, wonky the whole motivation to kind of um tell my story uh, on youtube it came from discovering Christine Guzman and all these fitness people um, and I had an amazing time. Thank you to Aisha who took me and who stood in the line for six hours while I went and saw Dana and Bailey and did other things. She, oh, what, what babe? What, who does that? What babe? Um, also met Harrison Brothers who are the loveliest guys. Uh, anyway, I spoke about all that in my last video and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I feel amazingly better than last week today and I think that's just motivation from the weekend. My mood has been turned around. Um, I almost feel like I've come out the top of a kind of depression like, like last week and I didn't want to use the word depression last week but I think I genuinely was depressed. Um, but I'm, I'm more positive today. I've, I've got things I want to do this week. I've got work um, and I'm looking forward to life this week rather than last week I was thinking I was surrounded by cancer and it was a weight on top of my head 
Um, I'm looking forward to the journey. Again, like I was before last week, I was looking forward to the journey, but now, I, now I've got it back again. <laughs> This is the one, the light. We go to Lidl and get our food shop. And Aisha goes, eh, is there any chance we can go to Asda? Why do we not need to go to Asda, babe? To get my chocolate bars. What chocolate bars do you want? Dairy milk. Why are they so special to you, baby? They're really, they're really good. They're better than any other chocolate bar. So we're gonna go home and chill out. It's a very special day today because Aisha is coming spinning. <laughs> Eight till nine, I'm teaching spin, and uh, there was one space left. And we have to leave it to the day to book her on. And then I booked her on today, and then she's coming. It's gonna be good. So we're out having dinner in our garden. How cute is this? Throwback to the other day when I did the garden, by the way. Now. Oh, I am about to do some gardening. It's a bit of a shit state at the minute. Look at that. Getting rid of that mattress and taking all that down. This is before and after. Keep them shut. But now we both Step. can't see anything. Yeah, I can see. My life. Open. Wow. Oh my <laughs> god. It's, it's still that, a shit state. No, it's not at all. So we're having an early dinner because we are spinning later. Sunglasses? So this is my setup for today. So what we got? We've got two monsters. I need to take another one. I've got pear, I've got grenade bar, I've got my meal, I've got my BCAs, got my pre-workout in the bottom of that, and I've got my protein in the bottom of that. I'm really late. I've got a day at work, but I've got something really exciting that happened yesterday that I've got to tell you about. Um, I was on Christian Guzman's vlog. Incredible. And here it is right now. Hey guys, my name's Emily and I came to visit Alfie today at Birmingham and I wanted to show my support because I think Alfie are a great company and uh, people like me who are going through cancer, I'm quite a brain tumor at the minute, um, really help and inspire me to drive forward. And I hope Tim's mum pulls through and gets better. Thank you so much, Alfie, and hopefully see you next year. How cool is that? How cool is that? I was just like blessed that I was going to get that opportunity to even be there and do something. And then I actually put it on. Damn it. How cool is that? on guys welcome to this workout commentary I'm just gonna talk a bit about my workout today um, it's a bit of a weird one I trained shoulders and biceps or delts and biceps started off with the machine shoulder press and I did four sets with a drop set at the end working my way from 15 kilograms worked on to some shrugs here um, I don't usually do shrugs because my traps are quite a hench for a woman but we worked well with them and I just wanted to get that cap on my shoulder a little bit more rounded. And then I follow them up by leaning lat rays, okay? Simple, quick and really effective for the uh, deltoid. Bicep curls here, uh, just started off warming up with the dumbbell curls. Standing, simple, uh, just to get that contraction going, ready for some more isol isolation work. I'm doing a three day split in the minute so I'm kind of all over the place and just getting back into the groove of my kind of workout split. I'm just kind of trying to train everything twice a week without overdoing it too much but it seems to be the most effective way to train for me. I move on here to some seated front raise, um, parallel grip just to work the front and not to put pressure on my wrists and then I superset this one with some bent arm lat raises okay just to get that mass on the shoulder on the side rather than doing too much of the straighter arm lat raises super set in here and then i do a drop set at the end to finish off and really really burn out the shoulder i really prefer seated lat raises to get that extra burn and no movement in the upper body 
And here I do a bicep seated isolation, isolation curl. I really squeeze at the top and extend down at the bottom, supersetting it with drag curls on the barbell. And that was my shoulders and bicep workout, guys. Really simple, really effective. Finished it off with 20 minutes on the cross trainer to get that heart rate up. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. I think the best thing about fasted cardio, fasted training, is the fact that you get to come home and you've got, you've got your breakfast to look forward to. Hot, hot, hot. So I'm going to do is, um, I don't know if to have a shake or some porridge. I'm loving this protein by the way, it's really good, really nice mixability. So I'm going to enjoy this. Actually tastes really good with the strawberry powder. It might seem a bit weird, but um, I'm gonna edit some video. I wanna hopefully get this video up today because um, I'm so eager to show you how um, much I'm back on board with the training and things. I'm proud. I'm happy. It's been a good week so far, and it's gonna be. It's gonna carry on being a good week because uh, I can feel it in my bones. going on guys I'm just prepping up some food and making some lunch for now can you see me can you see me I don't know should we put you over this way it's a bit better isn't it um so yeah this video was just about me getting back into training it feels great to feel strong again um I've totally come out the other side of last week's depression which I'm really chuffed about I was starting to think oh god is this the start of something quite long term but luckily it's not um, my main priority now is now I'm feeling strong. I just need to make sure I just feeling just as strong. So yeah, two really good workouts in this. I know it, both were shoulders, and I'm sorry, but um, I, next workout I'm gonna film is gonna be legs because because I haven't done one of them in such a long time. So yeah, I look forward to that. Um, thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.